Hi, this is Danica Louie and I build WordPress membership site. And in this video, I just want to record this so that I could share this progress thing that I'm working with and using GamePress. So the website is using this add-on and in their website, as you can see, it says you could create some progress bar and progress like radial format using the setup that you have in your website using the like achievements points badges and so on and you could even do this kind of format in that one so they have some examples here now this client contacted because they're wondering why their um progress bar and the stuff here is not working so i just want to share the solution that i have did for this client so they have three types, I mean four types of points. So they have content, connection, alignment, and then cumulative earnings. So this is like a total earnings that they have. They do want to create some reset options for their members, but I haven't touched that part. But just to give you an idea. So this progress bar is not working. It was just blank. There's no data. There's also not counting. And they noted that they're using the short codes for the gaming press progress. So I've dived in and checked their setup. So far they have like did this properly. No problem here. I think it's in the short code that um, they needed to update it. So I'm going to share that with you. By the way, you could check all of the Gaming Press, Gaming Press short codes in this. Um, let me just check. So in this link, I'm just gonna copy and paste that here. So that's the link, gamingpress.com docs short codes. So you could go in there and check all of the short codes that they have. Most of the time, short codes is a bit confusing, but if you just like check one by one, what I do is I kind of check it one by one and see. What options do they give you? But sometimes it's it does is um it does confuse them sometimes. So I have save here. So this was their original code. Um in terms of the progress bar, so this is the code that they have used in this section. So that's the one. And then this one is the earning. This is for the points basically. But the one that they have here is actually it's not because in their loom, this is supposedly the design. Um, it should be total points, but what they have is they have like a um, list of achievements here rather than the points. So if I edit this now, by the way, if you're having a um, hard time with any um, page builder, you could go to the layer, even in Elementor or other like bricks, uh, bricks. They do have this layer type. And you could check easier the codes that you have. So example in the content here, if I click this gear icon one more time, it will pop up and show me the short code. So I'm just going to do a comparison here. And then I'm also going to open the overall growth. I think it's this one. And then I'm just going to save and reload because I noticed sometimes that happens. While waiting for that one, let me just label this properly. So I'm going to do red for the older codes. And then these are the new ones. Okay, let's open that again. Go to layer. And then open that row column. And then in the text, this is their short code. Do note that this client also messaged me with another notes. I haven't checked on that yet, but let's focus on making sure your short code works based on how you need it to, especially for the progress bar and this points. Now what I do is, example, if this is the add-on that you're using, click this documentation and it should give you ideas here though again sometimes that's confusing so what i do here is in the short codes um i also check stuff in here 
but example documentation progress they do have a link to the short codes in here okay and then so in terms of the progress bar they do have four four types so when calling points type you need to use the slug so content so it doesn't need it should have no space it could have some characters like this hyphen and then um, example here originally the code is this one so game press progress from connection and then so the from is connection and the points type is credits oops so that's the original code now i changed that um so gave me press progress from the from is the like the type because example here if we check the from this is the game press progress short code you could see from choose from progress will be calculated so they give you different options as you can see points type points achievement type achievement rank rank type rank current rank and so on current user yes so you could also do that now if you scroll down so example i think if you click um okay that doesn't work but as you can see here the from um the example if you choose point type they do give you some explanations here now let's check what I've did. So so my from is points rather than the connection, which is in the original short code. And then my points, I follow that so it's over 100. And here in the points type is where I set the type. So the type is again this one, content connection alignment. And that's the one that the website or the client is using from the from, from their from value. Okay, so the from is points in here so let's just highlight that and then i did add so from the from connection in the original short code that they did i did change that to points and then because it is points like you're using the points in here but of course you have different points type so that's where you will specify the points type in this part so you have from and then you have points type we still have the 100 points now these are just a bunch of like styling that you could do but you do you do need to decide the type this one before deciding what um customization you want here because it, it's different so example here if you check the type here okay so bar status attribute type is equals to bar then this will be your um, options for styling it. You could do bar color, background color, text, text color, and so on. You could even add some animation. But if you do the radial bar, which is the circle thing, the one that they have, um, then you need to use this attribute. If the type is image, you need to use this, and so on. So it really depends on what you are going to use in terms of layout. If it's a progress bar, or is it a radial one so this will change this part but this two things is super important so the from again the from you need to decide whether you're doing that from the points and achievements ranks and then you then need to decide if you have a specific point type then you need to decide the point up here and that did fix the problem now next is the um, counting the points especially for this one they're using they said that they want to use the cumulative earnings because that's their total basically so from this short code this is like earnings user so this will like list all of those so example if we check this short code it should be this one so it's this um, layout you will have this like listing and it'll have some dates and how many points they got from that and the description it's like um table format so that's the user earnings now in their case they only want to use the they only want to show the points so like in this format so social score so that's why i changed that from earnings to points so um, if you check the short code here, it says um, points. 
So these are all of the attributes that are available for you. Do note that you could like show different um, points. So example, they could show all of their points like in this format. And there is like a column, um, how many columns you want and so on. But in my case here, I only need to grab this type. So if we check the points shortcode and do the type, um, it says single or comma separated list of points points types to display it does accept all for the value but the default is again all so if you don't set like type if you don't set this it will basically if it's like that then basically it will pull all of the points system that you have here to pull of that data but i did set it to be just this type and then current user because if you don't set that to yes it will pull all of the total points that your website has and then i turn off the label because they have this specific design where they have the label here and just the points here so you could do that so this is game press progress uh, bar and points um, i just really want to share this video so that if you have like specific question about this short code please comment that down below and i'll do my best to help you on that one but again do again their um like documentation is super complete but sometimes it is confusing and they don't have i don't think they have like some videos that specifically points to where uh, which one you need and doesn't um but they just give you this overall shortcode, which sometimes you don't need all of those parameters. Actually, you just need to decide which one is the one that you, which attributes do you need to control your um, um, points or progress. And as you can see, we did have a longer version here because we want to set the bar color, the background, and so. And then this one, we do have a shorter one because we don't need any label. You don't need any of this um, and you just want to show this part so i hope this video helps and if you have any question comment it down below and i'll do my best to get back to you so thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one bye, -bye.